Hey everybody, it's Giraffe, and I'm going to show you how to use the Auto CVVC plugin for Utau. So what you're going to need is the plugin itself, and if you want the English patch that I made for it, um, yeah, that's all you really need. And you need Utau and a CVVC voice bank, um, but that's really all you need. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to find the plugin folder inside of Utel, and I have it, the voice folder bookmarked, so I just went there. So what you need to do is go to like your PC, your C drive, um, program files, x86, and Utel. If you installed it somewhere else, then you'd probably know where you installed it. But yeah, that's where you want to put it. And then um, in the Utel folder, you have all these uh, these files, and you want to find the pro uh, plugins folder. And in there will be the plugins that you have installed into Utel. If you have any installed, these are the ones I use. Um, then you're going to want to drag this folder in here. But since I already have it in with like presets and stuff, I'm not going to drag it in. And um, that's pretty much all you need to do to install it, like outside of Utel. And to install the English patch, what you're going to need is uh, text.ini, and you don't want to change the name because that's like the one it uses. Um, so what you're going to want to do is drag this just into the folder and just click replace it. I hope that was the right one. Uh, yeah, it was. Okay. Um, and then you don't need this folder anymore, so you can just get rid of that and open Utau. Um, so in Utau, I already have a, I'm using Ritsu Eve, and I'm also, I made a UST of Kaeru no Utaga, which, um, it's a song. Yeah. Okay. So if you installed it right, you want to go to tools, plugins, and click reload if Utau was previously open. If not, you should be fine. And then go to plugins. It'll be like auto CVVC 1.23. And then it, mine says A. I don't know if it can say that for other ones, but yeah. Um, then click open and it'll run and this will open. And if you have the English patch installed, it'll look like this. If not, it'll have a bunch of Japanese text um, pretty much saying the same things. So anyway, um, since I'm using Ritsu Eve, uh, you wanna, I have to drag down and click Eve Risuto and that means Eve list, like the list that is that was used to record this voice bank, and you're gonna want to click load. Now, depending on which ones you use, I mean, you could probably put click default for any of them, any CVVC in general. But um, some of them have different lists. Like I made my own CVVC list, so I have it in here. Um, there's the there's a bunch of different ones that come with it, I think. So you want to so after that you want to click you want to click load. Okay, then. Um, I'll just explain what all of this does. You want to change the alias to um, CVVC. You can also use this to turn CVVC USTs into VCV, and CV to VCV, and VCV to CV, and VCV to CVVC, and CV to CVVC. It's it's like a converter, pretty much. Um, this places the dash at the beginning, like the the beginning note for uh, C, uh, VCV. Um, you, that doesn't really need to be used in this, but you can if you want. Um, this adds end breaths um, with these presets. I think you can add more, not, not completely sure, but I'm not going to use it because this is just like a simple thing. Yeah. No, actually, no, I will use it to show what it does. And Ritsu doesn't have any of these, so never mind. Um, uh, you want to make sure that you have this on and keep that as this. Um, this is where like all the presetting is done. Uh, like type this is for the consonant and this is for the vowel like this well these are vowels these are consonants i don't think you want to change any of these to vowel or else i hope i didn't mess anything up but uh yeah this it, this means that these are the consonants and this is like what is edited here um the length of the consonants chosen but this is already all completely made for the eve list so you don't have to worry about that um, other functions you want to turn all these off because what this does is this, this estimates the parameters you want to have for like the stuff yeah um and it messes with the ust and it makes it very hard to edit and crossfade i do that myself so you don't really need to do that um this this does something with the rest notes i just completely turn that off I, I wasn't completely sure what to like translate this to so i would just leave that off so after you have everything picked to what you want you can just click okay oh oh i forgot to select the ust make sure you have the notes that you want to convert selected Oh, that was not good. Okay, hold on. Um, yeah, okay. Um, and then when you open it up, it'll sound like this. It's loading. Oh, I have the wrong resampler. Oh, well. That's 
That's what it sounded like. It sounded kind of gross because the, the, the VC sounds aren't cross-faded. So what you're going to want to do is hit reset a couple times just to reset everything. And then P2P3, which is after ACPT, this applies automatic parameter adjustment, which like if there's notes that have um, exclamation points, which sometimes will happen with this, you want to click that and it should fix them. If not, then you might have to edit the envelopes yourself. This overlaps or this crossfades, this crossfades. I don't really know what that does. And then this resets everything back to what it would be like if you didn't click anything. And yeah, I just, I picked two, P2, P3 for this, which I mean, you could use P1, P4, or P2, P3. Either one is fine. Um, and then you're going to want to click pitch. Make sure that you don't have any tuning done on this before or else editing will be a pain. And then make sure that per, per, portamento is chosen and click OK. Then uh, you got the, the dashy thingamajigs. And then you're going to want to make sure, I mean, uh, yeah, you're going to want to make sure that there's no modulation, which sometimes there's modulation and sometimes there isn't. So just make sure you set that to zero and you set this to 100. Um, you can click, you can choose consonant velocity, but I don't think it needs this for this because this song doesn't really have any like super fast syllables. Um, but yeah, make sure STP is cleared too. And flags, make sure there's no format filter. Yeah. Um, make sure you can put 50 breath. I'll probably put 50 breath for now since I'm using a resampler, like a regular resampler. And that's pretty much it for now. <clears throat> then I'm going to play this. Oh, wait. No, you want to have make sure that that is clicked. Uh, yeah, I, I, I don't know. Well, anyway, yeah, you want to make sure that that doesn't have a check. <clears throat> but that's what it sounds like. This is what it sounds like with the CVVC like stuff in it. Everything blends, blends, blends pretty nicely, um, but for this voice bank in particular, I don't really like the uh, the the way that it blends the R sounds, the Japan the the ru like rari rudero. So I just delete it. But for the other one, it sounded okay. Yeah, that didn't sound too bad. Um, but that's pretty much all you need to know. Um, yeah, that it's it's pretty simple. Not it's nothing too complicated. Um, but if you have any questions, may, um, make sure you ask me because I'll be able to help most likely. All right. Well, I hope this was helpful to you. And, um, yeah, if, there, if you have any questions, just ask me because I'd be more than happy to help. Um, have a nice day.